the, the program gives a, a base introduction to the discipline of software engineering, how to build large-scale software in, in large teams, uh, uh, possibly uh, distributed around the world. And uh, so that's the first, the core of the, of the degree, and there is a core module that sort of gives the principles of software, introduces the principles of software engineering. Then there is the specialization modules, and we have a specialization module in Tallinn and a specialization module in Tartu. The specialization in Tallinn is uh, about uh, uh, embedded and real-time systems. So this is how to develop software that goes into mobile phones, uh, into PDAs, into all sorts of mobile devices. So, so it's about developing software for that type of application. So things that go into small embedded devices and, and that need to be uh, a very responsive in real time, they have to be processing data. And the second specialization is the one that we do in Tartu, and that is more um, classical type of software uh, that you see in, in enterprises, you know, software for handling, invoicing, payment, uh, you know, payrolls, and, and so on. So that's what we call enterprise software, mm -hmm. broadly. Scholarships for the international students, and, and we roughly have something like eight scholarships in, in this program. Uh, and those ones will be given to, let's say, the top 20% uh, of applicants. I have been at least in, in six different countries, and um, and I, I was uh, I am very so positively surprised of Estonia. I am uh, I think they have a, a very good infrastructure in the universities, very good structure, support structures for students, and in, in particular international students and for international staff. My main message is. Uh, our universities and uh, Estonia as a country is ready to open itself to international students, to international collaborations in the academic world, and I hope that those uh, students will bring with them contacts and networks that will allow us to develop uh, stronger ties with universities in, 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 in Turkey as well. We will be very interested perhaps in having some collaborations in research with Turkey and, and having uh, perhaps some, some joint PhD degrees, uh, supervision of, of joint PhD projects. I hope this program is going to be a platform to enable collaboration with a number of countries, and Turkey is particularly uh, a country uh, to which we give uh, a particular priority. The master's program has a, a, an internship component, so students have to complete uh, either a three-month project in collaboration with industry or a three-month internship embedded into the, the industry. In Estonia we have st very strong ties between uh, universities and, and, and industry. Uh, possibly about um, one-fifth of our um, uh, courses are, are taught by, by people who uh, move between industry and academia. The fact that the program, of course, has a, a master's thesis component, which is uh, essentially one semester, typically the last semester in the program. And, um, and there, uh, the, I think the students will benefit from the, the strong uh, the existing research groups that exist both in Tallinn and in Tartu in a broad range of fields. There is still a need for, for high quality uh, IT professionals, especially software engineers uh, in, in, in Estonia and in neighboring countries, in Finland, in Sweden, uh, uh, Nordic countries and elsewhere in Europe. Um, so yes, I, I think it is, uh, the, in terms of career prospect, this is a very good we are in a very good position at the moment.